For the third straight day, we were reporting on a different young police officer in trouble with the law. This time it's 23 year old Tyler Peak, an officer with Taylor Police. He's charged with assaulting a man at a gas station. Larry Spruill live with more on these charges and how things uh, escalated in this incident. Larry. Well, good evening, Devin. It all started with a police pullover between that police officer and that victim. Here's what happened. Judge, we would just ask that any bond be set with the condition of no contact with the complainant in this case. Wednesday, 23-year-old Taylor Police Officer Tyler Peake told a judge he was not guilty. Officer Peake is charged with misconduct in office for committing an assault and battery on April 1st, 2020. Prosecutor Kim Worthy's office said the man who was assaulted by the officer was allegedly involved in a domestic disturbance with his girlfriend. He was later pulled over by Officer Peake after leaving the house. Worthy's office said Peake allegedly allegedly walked up to the car and pointed his gun at him. According to police, Peek allegedly struck him multiple times on the ground after forcibly removing him from the car. The misconduct in office charge is a common law felony that carries a maximum penalty of up to five years in prison. The assault and battery charge is a misdemeanor. Now, Taylor Police Chief released this statement about the case. It says the city of Taylor Police Department was notified this afternoon by the Wayne County Prosecutor's Office that they will be charging one of our officers in connection with the police matter. The officer has been placed on unpaid administrative leave pending the outcome of the criminal case. And an officer was also given a personal bond. He cannot have any contact with the victim whatsoever. His CPL was also suspended and he is due back in court on September 8th. We're live tonight. Larry Sproul, Local 4. Such an amazing streak of similar stories here this week. All right, Larry.